demand for electricity here is estimated to reach its highest so far on Monday and Tuesday, with both days exceeding the 100 gigawatt mark at one point for the first time ever. Our Park go has more. South Korea has seen its highest power demand so far for this summer during the past few days. According to the Korea Power Exchange, the estimated average electricity use between 2 to 3 p.m. on Monday and Tuesday surpassed 100 gigawatts. This is the first time in history for the power demand to exceed this mark. Over the past few years, the country has continued to see increasing record power demand. After it topped 90 gigawatts for the first time in 2018, it reached almost 95 gigawatts last year, also breaking the peak of the previous year. An expert says this year's record high demand is due to the prolonged extreme weather. The reason why demand for electricity shot up this summer is because of the continued scorching heat since June. If the hot weather continues for more than one week without cooling down even a bit, there's a dramatic increase in power demand. He also attributed the recent peak to Typhoon Kanun, raising temperatures as it approaches the country, alongside businesses returning to full operation after summer breaks. Responding to the situation, the second vice industry minister, Kang kyung sung inspected the Seoul Incheon Electricity Control Center, which is the preliminary backup facility to supply power nationwide, as a last resort in emergencies. The ministry also announced that it will continue to run the emergency system until the end of the summer and prepare for Typhoon Kanun that is expected to travel the length of the Korean peninsula. Park Geun-woo, Arirang News.